There we go. I've clicked new game. Okay, go ahead.
end of one nightmare really to the another. Oh my god! One has fallen without realizing his final hold. Forgot how long that fucking intro cutscene was! That Goku's it's only apparently six allergic. Minutes. It's only like six minutes. Goku was allergic to that cutscene. He sneezed during it. How did you hear that even on this damn stupid one? Came through on the stream. He has the ears of a snake. Ear. Even though I had it, even though I had it muted, it still <laughs> went through. Oh. Yeah, we didn't get a chance to order show. Hi! Welcome to Anime to Dodge Dreams, the last mainline game in the series. He's half come don't know how to revive their damn IPs. Uh, the bus you're gonna get is I'm being a shitty costume or something. I mean, hey, it could be it, it could be worse. You could be a, co a shitty costume in a shitty DLC that only has the name going for it. I mean, hi, Regina. Oh, didn't they let the Dino Crisis trademark expire? Yeah. Yes. Yes, they did. Yeah, the last th the last cost. thing that uh, time she was uh, that it was ever acknowledged was in that Dead Rising Three DLC that people only knew the name of and never played because it was not good. Uh, it has a Regina costume. I is I I uh, <laughs> But hey, okay, no need to be sad, right? It's not like this, another one of those uh, part ones or whatever we had to record a second time. Looking at you, Clock Tower 3 and Haunting Ground. Actually, didn't talk about we had to redo the whole fucker. We did for half of Haunting Ground, too. <laughs> You pop that away. Oh no, Shrek. <laughs> yeah, so with Only Wish Done Dreams, as you can tell, they went for more DMC like gameplay. And And trust me, we're gonna compare it a lot to Itsuno shit, especially with how some of the moves are literally totally not Stinger. Nope. They're not. <laughs> It's like Stinger, but it isn't. Oh my god, look at these Genma! We Just found, look at- We found grass. Oh no! Grass! You have Legabon? That one. But yeah, yeah, as you all can see, this game does the whole stage system. Totally not like missions from Devil May Cry. Definitely not. We pop out. And we're totally not playing as a white-haired dude like in Deep Six. Okay, I'll stop. Oh, he's with his blonde hair. He's totally different. Wait, okay, you're ahead. You're gonna have to let us know when a uh, cutscene comes up, so we don't risk talking over it. Or I guess sneezing over it. <laughs> no talking. Oh no. He sure does love to kill him. I mean, fuck the scenery. Yeah, this game definitely went way more animu than the first three games in the series. But is that a bad thing? Yeah. Oh, 
on, Goku, you've got this! Even though I don't think you can die in this stage, actually. It's what you would say, if you don't know a thing about... stuff. I'm gonna get some person showing up. I've actually died on this stage 17 times and never made it past it. Okay, good for you. <laughs> Go box play Fortnite. <laughs> <laughs> uh, talk about dying, I did die. Oh, well, joke's on you dying. Goku found a way to die on this stage. They're like, I don't think you can die in this stage. At least I never had that Goku die. It's like, oh, shit. Don't worry, Goku. These Genma are nothing. Just look at them. I mean, look at the shirt they're wearing. Okay, third, uh, we're... He doesn't have a sword anymore. Big guy. Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice what? Nice spitting out shit. Oh. I thought I'd to say he had nice tits. I was gonna be like, what? <laughs> I said shit. I mean, they are pretty much. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> I have a cutscene here. Yeah, it is. The age of warring states. Nobunaga had attempted to unite the lands under his rule using the Genma. However, the Onimusha were able to halt his blind ambition. Nobunaga perished amidst the flames at Honoji Temple. The massive army of Genma that had plagued the land vanished. After Nobunaga's demise, his retainer Hideyoshi Toyotomi united Japan. It seemed that he had finally put a stop to the fear and panic that came with the age of warring states, bringing a much welcomed peace. Overnight, the omen star appeared in the sky. That day, Hideyoshi was overcome by a mysterious change, and Japan was once again thrown into chaos. The repeated massacres on the continent. The slaughter of everyone on board the captured western ship San Felipe. The banishment of foreigners and the executions of holy men. A tempest rages through the land yet again under Hideyoshi. Meanwhile, a great earthquake rocks Fushimi Castle in Kyoto. In its wake, other catastrophes wreak havoc across Japan. The peace is shattered, and nothing is left untouched. 
As if called forth by the terror brewing in human hearts, Genma begin to reappear, slaughtering all in their path, bringing panic and despair to the world. Fifteen ninety-eight. Mocking the destruction of the world, the Omen Star appears, shining bright in the heavens, foreshadowing something sinister. Makes me feel warm and fuzzy. So, how long before Capcom lets this IP expire? Soon. Next. Stage two the blue demon. I like blue. Of course. Two years do. later, cutscene. Kichi. Yep. Are you ready? Yep, I'm fully prepared. We're going to do this just like we planned. Right. Young one, what business do you have? Oh, great and noble warrior. I beseech you to spare your precious time and listen to my humble request. <laughs> Cute. You may speak. Would you just drop the goods and go home? What did you say? Ruffian, you do know these belong to Lord Hideyoshi. Right, Lord Hideyoshi. Leave the cherry trees where they are and I might let you live, Danyemon. How did you know my name? Spill the blood of countless enemies. You shall pay for your insolence. <laughs> Please, you don't stand a chance against me. Leave him to me. The rest of you, take this to the fortress in Saruga. Sorry, I'm afraid not. <laughs> Guess you won't be going that way, huh? Are you going to head back? Challenge me. Hmm? Ugh, it reeks. Hey, you didn't eat the bugs, did you? A present from my lord. These bugs give me the ability to fight, and I have had my fill. The more of them I eat, the stronger I become. So, you did eat them. Well, I guess that means I have to kill you. You know too much, thief. You've made yourself a dangerous enemy. Prepare for a painful death. You know my name. Now it is time to tell me your... My name, eh? My name is none of your concern! <laughs> Oh, who, who does it mark out over the whole samurai shit? Fucking awesome, right? I said a cutscene, the guy was like, How did you know my name? I've killed countless enemies! I'm famous, but how did you know my name? 
This guy might not be too smart, I don't know. So, um, who's hyped for the new Kenshin anime? It's gonna be great, right? Right? Who's Kenshin? The kill sword. Dick. Yeah. Never heard of it. See, Nori anime would be kind of cool, but, um. No, thank you. Know. It was Dawn of Dreams movie. Uh, I don't know if it was any good, though. It was never done, so fuck it. Hey Goku, can you take this guy on? Or is he gonna struggle, snuggle you? It has infinite friends spawning around him, too. Come on! Block! I know it's one of the triggers. It might be R1 or L1. Are you triggered? Or you? Remember, I had the same problem with this one kid before. I know. The controllers are shit of a freak. Can't buy new ones! Yeah, I don't think anyone's gonna argue the PS3 controller sucks dick. The PS3 controller is just so delicious. Hey, get away from me! Dog. <sighs> No, 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 no! Splat. I deed. Oh. I deed. Doomed Don't worry. Space. It could be like Dino Crisis 3 where you're doomed in space. Would you believe I never played Dino Crisis? Well, first one, the first two are good. Well, the second one is divisive, but well, I don't think it's good. the first one is good if you have a fetish. For puzzle boxes. And the second one, if you're into the over the top dumb action. The first two are alright, and the third one, though. No, the third one sucks. Who thought platforming in a fixed camera angle Resident Evil setting would be a good idea? Because I'm, I'm just not seeing it. The first one does not have much in the ways of action. In fact, 99% of the encounters are skippable. You could even skip a lot of the boss fights, too. The first yeah. one. You, you just have to bring enough ammo for the... ...scripted fights. Or even like just this. run just around bring... for long enough in some of them. Just bring your samurai sword to every fight and you're good. No, they added swords in Battle Crisis 2. They had laser swords. Exactly. That, that you used just to open fences. Wait. <laughs> this sounds kind of dumb if you say it out loud. Oh, Capcom. Back in the days when they cared more about making games that were fun and interesting instead of just, well, whatever the hell they're doing now. Hey, you can say what you want about Dino Crisis 3. They took a risk, though, and that's something the fucking companies could care to do more. You know, it was something. They tried. Was it good? No. It was an idea. Well, also, you think we have only Musha? Because they took Not a every shot. Every idea time. is a good idea. Yeah, but now all these companies just. Hey, we can only make sequels from now on. That's all we know how to do. They don't even know how to make functional games anymore. And why the indie scene is taking off the way it is. Hi, Bloodstain. Ow, ow, ow. Which ritual the fuck you kill Nami? I deed. We're gonna Doomed be here a bit. Space. I deed. Doomed in space. But it's okay, because at least we know 
that this big man will eventually go down when we thrust our sword into him. So, um... Yeah, uh, did anyone think they'll ever make uh, remasters no. for the Alicia games? They no. They're like, oh no, okay, we're done. They just only get one. They're not going to take a risk on two. Yeah. I only wish the one remaster was honestly bare bones compared to their other outings that they usually do. A lot of Capcom games are bare bones. Not every yeah, but I'm saying like look at their look at their remasters. They usually include like art galleries, sound tests, interviews, making ofs. Tony Misha came with nothing. It was literally just the game, and it was it no, wasn't even the Genma version. Yeah, it wasn't even the Genma version either. And it's OST is yeah, it's good one. It's not as good. <laughs> Why do you run? Let me into your anus! I don't I think that's how it goes. I found grass! That's is that hot. Right? No, I think grass is... No, that's... no I thought that... I think that might be a herb. Come on, stick your sword grass. in! He did! He did! He did! Right, he did. Ah, what the fuck? Why are you chasing after me for? Dead. My name is Soki, the Oni of the Ash. I wish you better luck in the next life. Kichi. Yeah? Get ready. Alright. Just dispatch the infested Danimo with ease. He must be the blue demon that's destroying Lord Hideyoshi's trees. Quite formidable. But he's not my problem. Should I kill him anyway? It's... it's him. I finally found him. What? <sighs> what a coincidence. The blue demon is famous for being a traitor to Lord Hideyoshi. If that's the case, maybe I shouldn't be so quick to cut him down. It looks like we need to find another batch of cherry trees. Time to go. Way to do it. I know. And we're done. Okay, hold on. Couple of things, real quick. So, yes, don't think we commented. Mino Kichi, everyone assumes, is the descendant of the. Old man who hangs upside down. Psycho, I gotta love in that cutscene. He was like, Well, he dispatched him with ease after we died how many times? Yeah, very easily. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, I'll have to switch. <laughs> Alright.
Did your Twitch just echo back to you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, the dolphin. Taking the dolphin to yourself to a whole new level, aren't we? I know I'm mad. <laughs> I missed this game series, damn it, Capcom, why? But join us for part two, which we already did, I guess. But if you're on YouTube, you'll see it soon. Go, Goku.